gondola in Venice. from Milan for two and a half hours or three hours to Venezia Santa Lucia and we booked a round trip ticket for 50 euros per person back and forth round trip tickets today is also a beautiful day I also noticed that it's a little breezier here than in Milan in Pisa maybe because we're right beside the water so it's a little bit chiller I like the weather here good morning everyone Good morning! Italy is our 23rd country together. Wow, two more countries, huh? Not that we're keeping count, but it's our 23rd country together. Uh -huh. I do keep count because that's how I am. Oh, they're leading the way since they've been here. Look at the, all those water boats. Martin, are you excited to ride a gondola with me? Yeah. Hindi ah, naman. Yeah. I feel the love ha. Parang hindi mo gusto. Yeah, I was looking. Ah. So you can take the water boat taxi for a faster, you know, journey. If you're in a hurry or you're going somewhere. But for us, we're gonna walk. We're gonna walk and later gondola. Ang shala naman ng water taxi dito. Eighteenth birthday, I had a masquerade party. Very happy to be here in Venice and seeing all of these masks. Yeah, Reminds me of my eighteenth uh, birthday. I just bought these. Thanks, marvelous ladies. I love dangling earrings. I just feel like it completes the look without overdoing, you know, over accessorizing. Yeah, that's the only. Almost got some pancakes. I'm the type of person who eats salty for breakfast. Okay, we are crossing the bridge to the center, to the city center of Nice. Here in Italy, there's a lot of walking involved, so make sure to wear comfy shoes and be prepared to get at least 10,000 steps a day. It's a workout, but it's a nice workout because you get to see beautiful spots like these. We're in Venice! What I'm excited about is riding that gondola like this. Okay, 
Okay, so this is the map of Venice and then they said we're gonna cruise around this area for about 20-30 minutes. Enjoy guys! See you! See you in 30 minutes! Enjoy! First time in Venice, of course, you need to experience the gondola! Thank you! Whoopsie! Oh wow, it's Rocky! Rocky Balboa! Charret! <laughs> the maximum capacity for a gondola is only five persons. We're with Tita Baby or Mama. Mama ba o Tita? It's like ma she's our mom now. <laughs> our Ital our mom in Italy. <laughs> We are now entering the canals. It's the start of the canals. From the canals in Amsterdam to, to Venice. Venice. <laughs> For you, because you want to have photos. Can you make it a bit higher? Because I look fat. Oh, wow. That's a nice shot. <laughs> but here it's the legit one. Oh, the one. <laughs> We're back from the gondola trip. We got dream come true. We got a lot of uh, good couple photos in there. Yeah. Baby really helped us with some wonderful photos, so mm. I thought it was really nice. I think for 80 euros, like 15 minutes, it was too short. It was way too short for the amount of money, so if you're only two people, it's quite expensive. But you can go, I think, up to four. Five. Up to five. You can be five people yeah. in there, and then it's more affordable. So. Because we're six, that's why we took uh, two. Yeah. Bring a friend. And <laughs> Hi. We are in a skinny alley. <laughs> it's always nice to see you know viewers everywhere I go. So whenever you see us, say hi. We really love taking photos with you guys and like asking who you are. Even the alleys here in Italy, it's pretty. Everywhere you look in Italy, pretty. Everywhere you go. It's picturesque. It's Instagram worthy. Google Maps works really well here. And that's what we are relying on. I wonder how it feels like to live here in Venice. I also heard that there's really not that much people who lives here. It's mostly Airbnbs now or hotels or restaurants. Finally, a less chaotic spot here in Venice. Look at how Italians put their sampais, like dry their clothes. Even when they're drying their clothes, it's aesthetic. Why does it look pretty? <laughs> All right. You can go ahead. <laughs> Thank you. All right, I got it. Yeah, like that. Right. You can go ahead. Thank you. Go ahead. Go ahead. You can go. It's okay. <laughs> Thank you. Maybe you put both of your feet up in there, like what I did. 
narrow streets you will never know where you will end up with maybe someone screaming i don't know what's happening okay so we've been walking for an hour now walking around venice and we found this spot nice spot with a shade this tree is perfect and also perfect height see it's a lot of shade Chilling. How are you guys feeling? Warm. Good. Warm. 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 Tired. <laughs> oh, yeah, you can go. <laughs> I don't know if you can see how big the cookies are here. It's four euros. Okay, bye. The famous bridge of Rialto. Very excited to see the Piazza Square. Oh. I must say, the only thing that I don't like about this place is that it's overcrowded. People get mad if you, you're blocking their photos unintentionally. I'm walking just here. And also, with me, it also goes the same me taking photos. Is that there's Always someone photobombing. Okay, I'm starting not to enjoy this place anymore. It's also making me dizzy because of the heat. This is Italy somewhere. I mean, don't get me wrong, I still love being here, but if you're going here in summer, this is what you need to expect. I think this is one of the downsides that Italy doesn't have any travel restrictions anymore, no more PCR tests. More people can come in, there's no like regulations anymore. So. Water traffic, gondola traffic. I just had a really, really bad experience with Romy. A girl was uh, pushing her cart, her like sales cart, and she was ringing bells so that everyone can move. And we can't hear the bells not until like a few meters away from her. And she literally pushed her, rang the bell right by her ears and didn't say sorry she's just like move 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 against you oh my gosh i never experienced anything like that in the world and i am furious i wanted to come after her but she was so hard i feel so bad because i could have done something i'm so sorry that's that's not nice made it at the famous saint mark square or the piazza san marco it's an iconic square and gathering place dating back to the 12th century and dominated by St. Mark's Basilica, which is right behind us. But unfortunately, 
some of the areas are closed down. Maybe there will be like a concert later on this afternoon. But yeah, here we are. Oh my gosh, I don't know where my friends are, Anna. I think I lost them. I don't know where they are. I am not in the Philippines. This is not Venice um, Piazza. What do you call that in BGC? This is way taller than that. You know, Venice is such a beautiful place. However, some of the rude locals kind of ruins it and the vendors ruins it. I think going here once is enough for me. And I also want to know if you've been to Venice, what was your experience? Was it like ours or you had a greater time than me? Take a water taxi going back to the oh, central. Oh my gosh! Oh wow, why? Ah, uh, oh no, she has a bread. Oh my gosh, be careful, be careful because these little makulit, when they see you're eating bread, they're gonna snatch it from you. You can also take the gondola here. Okay, we're in a hurry because we might miss our train going back to Milan. So, we need to find a place where we can ride the water taxi. So, unfortunately, that's it for Venice. We're only here for, I think, five hours. But if you have like two, three days extra, I would definitely recommend to stay here a night for a night or two. Oh, I would really love to buy some of these art pieces. Oil painting, wow. But we're leaving. I uh, love the gondolas. Okay, we're gonna take the water taxi this time. We got our tickets. Where did you, I know, Martin Samo Nilagai? Huh? Machine. Ah. Oh. Yeah, hold it. Beep. Ah, okay. Tanga <laughs> tang. Dumbass. This is the reason why I really don't well, do well when it's like there's pressure. I'm already dumb, I get dumber. My Venice! Arrivederci. Water taxi, the E1. E1 ko sayo. Our train going back to Milan because it's now what time? 30. So it leaves in 30 minutes. Right? Yeah, it leaves in 30 minutes. <laughs> and this water taxi stops in a lot of uh, places. Yeah. So let's see. Fingers crossed. 
I'm, it's not negativity, you it's real, no, it's realistic, no. it's being realistic. a water taxi and it costs 80 euros to get us to central station because we only have like 20 minutes to go until our train leaves. I have 20. I get 20. No, no. We will pay this right now. Because then also they have 20. So that I have still Martin, money. I don't have money. You have 20. I have some points. Let me see what I have. Ay nako, everyone's battling who will uh, pay because everyone wants to pay. <laughs> wow. You know when I was a teenager, everybody's battling with the Okay, you owe me one dollar, <laughs> you know? Every cent counts <laughs> <laughs> Do you know that movie? What's this movie uh, that was shot here of Johnny Depp and uh, Angelina? Hey. I think he's also taking a shortcut, this guy Because if not, if art, they will go on the big, uh, yeah. the big one, big canal. Hindi nagabul. I forgot about you guys. Sorry. We made it. That was a rush. And then you know what? We got so lucky because our train is 10 minutes late. Just in diamond. Yeah, so heading back to Milan. I think this is the most crowded place I've ever been mm -hmm. to. Except where the you Gloria Tunnel. <laughs> <laughs> or malls in the Philippines. Yeah, it's the same thing. <laughs> or Divisoria, Bakmara. Mm. But you know, I think, I'm not gonna lie, I think this is a place that I will only go once. And also the experience of what happened to Romy, where Fender was very rude to her. So like pushed her and that's not nice so kind of ruins the vibe but you know you can't win it all that's how traveling is it's not always fun you know it's a balance